y'all! Welcome back to Biteable. My name is Haley, and in this video, I'll be dissecting the performance data around paid Facebook ads. We ran a controlled experiment using real money and put video and image ads head to head. Find out which one came out on top. When it comes to Facebook ads, we've always found that video outperforms images. But we'd never run an experiment to prove it, so we put our money where our mouth is and set up an experiment. We created a 6 second video and ran it against an image with the same message, same call to action, and same design. Were we right? Did the video win? First, let's take a look at how we ran the experiment. For this experiment to work, we needed to standardize as many variables as possible. We created two ads in the same style, the same color, proportions, and visuals. The only difference, one was static and the one was moving. We used the same call to action for both ads. To remove any audience bias, we created a new Facebook page and ran both ads from that account called Video Lab. We served the ads to the same type of audience. And finally, we used the same budget for both. We threw down $225 per ad. The results of this experiment were interesting from a marketing point of view. I'll get into what it all means in a second, but let's go over the raw data first. The image ad was seen by 7,232 people. The video ad was seen by 9,532 people. The image ad got 32 clicks, costing us $7.11 per click. The video ad got 186 clicks, costing us $1.19 per click. The image ad got 16 leads, costing us $14.22 per lead, and the video got 59 leads, costing us $3.75 per lead. I can't say that every paid Facebook ads campaign will shake out this way, but I can see from our numbers that video kicked images butt. In every metric, video performed better. Overall, I learned quite a few lessons from the experiment. Video works well for conversions. The video ad was particularly effective for everyone's favorite advertising measure, conversions. If you're running a funnel, you should definitely be introducing video at the pointy end. And if you're not a video maker, don't worry. The Biteable Video Creator has thousands of templates to get you started. A good marketer knows the testing phase never really ends. Once you've settled on a campaign idea, A-B testing is your best shot at figuring out exactly what your audience wants to see. There are always exceptions. I'm not saying you should ditch the images entirely, but you should definitely try video if you haven't already. One place we found images consistently beat videos is in carousel ads. For paid ads, video is a better bet. Have you had similar results in your paid ads? If you want your next ad campaign to really impress, start making your own videos with Biteable. Make a video today and browse our video template library at biteable.com templates. And don't forget to follow, like, and subscribe for more videos just like this. Bye.